LibChat Guide, How to Create a New Conversion in Google AdWords Get to know which of your Google Ads campaigns are best at converting to chats on your site. In this short tutorial, you'll learn how to create a new conversion in Google Ads, and how to check if ad clicks result in new chats. To track how your Google Ads convert to chats on your site, follow these steps. 1. Log into your ads account and go to Tools and Settings Measurement Conversions from the top menu. 2. To add a new conversion, click on the plus icon in the top left. If this is the first time you create a conversion, you'll see a different view click on and conversions and proceed to the next step. 3. Choose website. 4. Select other in the category section. 5. Enter the name of the conversion. Use one that'll help you easily find it in the future. 6. Select don't use a value for this conversion action. 7. You can change all the other settings however it suits you. When you're finished, click on create and continue. All the settings can be changed later on. 8. Choose Google Tag Manager. 9. Copy the conversion ID and the conversion label. 10. Now paste the conversion ID and the conversion label values into the script we created, you'll find it below the instructions. 11. Once done, add the whole script to your site source code. Remember to place it below the LibChat installation code. Add code to track LibChat conversion with Google AdWords copy the script below and remember to change your underscore conversion underscore ID and your underscore conversion underscore label to the values provided in the conversion you created in Google Ads, as shown in steps 8 and 9. After you've added the script to your website, the chat conversion from ad clicks will start appearing in your ads conversion reports. Additional information. Track conversions to the ticket form you can also track conversions to ticket form. You need to replace the, to learn more about this callback, check out LibChat API documentation. Track several conversions at the same time. You can track several conversions at a time using the script provided above. To do so, add a separate script with different pairs of Google underscore conversion underscore ID and Google underscore conversion underscore label variables for each conversion you want to track. Google Tag Assistant Errors When using Google Tag Assistant, you might come across some syntax errors like conversion label not set or no HTTP response detected. Don't worry about them, as the integration will successfully track your ads campaign and integrate it with LibChat. When validating your AdWord campaign, Google Tag Assistant is looking for active conversion codes, including the version without JavaScript, Nascript. As our conversion tracking code does not have such a version, Google Tag Assistant may display errors.